Hello and welcome everyone. I am C.S. Gilmore, and this is Heroes of Highwall. Let's see how to play. Now this is a game by Santa Games. Hey, please, that's what it's called. Anyway, I'll put a link in the description. Check it out. Um, they contacted me, asked if I'd do a video review of this, and it looks like a pretty decent game. A uh, platformer style. Uh, let's see, what does it say? Highwall is under attack. The troll army have entered the city, burning everything as they go. Women and children are fleeing in all directions while the men on the streets have been surrounded. It is on the wall that the fate of our people shall be decided. Three brave heroes will have to stand against wave after wave of fierce trolls until he appears. The troll chieftain, Aegor the Cyclops, must be defeated to claim victory for Highwall. And... I'm sorry, one second. I just saw my screen dim, which usually suggests the battery's getting low. I didn't think to check that before I started. So controls, A, D, move left, right, space, jump, freeze, basic, primary, secondary, shift, Q, and E. Okay, so this may take a little bit of getting used to, but I think I can work with it. Options, pretty basic. Graphics by Fabian Bergval, and coding by Jonas Broman. Probably mispronouncing those horribly. Alright. Let's jump in and see what this looks like. So I could host a game or just join a game. I think this is designed to be multiplayer, though I'm pretty sure you can play solo. Alright. Don't know what all this is about. IP address? I don't even know. What about host game? Okay, maybe you just do host game if you want to play on your own. You can pick between archer, warrior, and wizard. And then if you don't have other people to play with, you can play with bots. So there is that. I'll go with the warrior for now. Okay, looks like pretty basic. Actually pretty quick too. Gotta watch my health. New ability leap. Boing. Okay, cool. Kinda like a super jump. Basically a super jump. Die. Ooh. The bots seem to be really competent. Don't see that in every game. Troll warrior slain. So I think the idea is you have seven waves of enemies in which to fight through. Okay, I can draw a shield out. Whoa, okay. I'm not doing so hot. There we go. Got some health back at least. Good, good, good. Much better. Uh oh, we lost Sven Eriksson. No, Sven. Ooh, hi there. You don't seem friendly. Okay, new ability, demoralizing shot. Oh, and if, if you complete a wave, you get everyone back. Okay, let's try this. Come here, you. I'm not quite sure what that did or how effective it was. Oh, it can stun. Ah. Okay, I like it. I like it a lot. Ah, you can interrupt people by jumping on them with their leap ability. Okay, I'm starting to figure this out. It looks like a pretty easy to pick up game. Challenging though. Boom. Whoa, okay. Do not fail, Sven. You are our last hope. 
Yes, good. Well done. Okay, I have to be more careful. Getting dead is bad for my health. There we go. I think it helps to stick with your allies. Definitely splitting up is dangerous. So far so good. Pretty basic battlefield. Stunned or asleep people. I don't know if that did me any good or not. Excellent. Ooh, throwing axe. I am interested in this. Ooh, I like it. It's a little awkward for me to use the controls. I wonder if there's a way to key map them. I should check that next time. Probably not right now, given the setup of this game. But not bad for a free-to-play game at all. This is actually really good. Boom! Interrupted. Okay, I think we're on the last wave. Wave 7. Bring me the troll key. Okay, he just killed me in a matter of seconds. He is tough. But it looks like it's mostly fighting him, so gotta work on dodging. Go guys, go! Dodge, dodge! Don't die! Don't stand together! Don't stand right next to each other like that. No! Oh, they're dead. Oh, he has a lot of hit points. He has like 10,000 hit points. Okay! Well. That was interesting. I'll have to play some of the other characters and try them out. I like the setup. Hmm. Very basic, not a bad free-to-play game. Definitely something these guys can put on their resumes, I would say that. Put on the resumes, get a good job somewhere. Definitely. Like, the graphics are basic, but it works. And it looks pretty nice. They've done a good job of creating a 3D background using 2D effects. So, yeah, I like it. Anyway. That was pretty short. Um, yeah, I'll give it one more go for this episode. Let's see. Let's try the wizard. Now nah, I'll save the wizard for last. I'll do archer. Okay, basics. Three arrow shot takes a little while to recharge. Okay, I like the range. Like, very nice range. Okay. Pretty basic damage. Dive roll. Woohoo! Okay. I'll have to figure that out, whether it's what it's good for. Probably a good dodge. Aim. Okay. How are you guys getting up here? Oh, okay. Boarding platform there. I see. What about the other side? Eh, same thing. Okay. Nice. Snipe you in the face. I know. Sucks for you. Um, allies, where did you go? There are people coming in from both sides. And you're off dancing around over there. Thank you. Okay, I can't just hold the attack button. I do have to click. So that's good to know. Hmm, seems my attack can kind of stun him. Sleep powder. Ooh. Looks like a stun attack then. No. 
Oh, ah, didn't dodge that very well. I'll work on my thoughts. Also, why aren't you dying? I think that may have been a little weird. Like glitched maybe or something. Or maybe it's a setup to try to stop you from just completely pawning an enemy if you've gone cornered. I'm not sure. Some weird setup there. Definitely something to keep in mind. Alright, you guys are going over there? Okay, we'll go your way. Ah, so that's how it works. Excellent. I do notice also the warrior has 150 health, the other two only have 100. So that's good to know also. Makes sense since the warrior has to get up close for everything. Stun you guys. Oh, nice. I guess that ice attack is the wizard's stun. No, this is Ven. You're a wizard. You aren't supposed to run ahead of everyone. Cluster arrow. Ooh. That sounds like fun. Cluster arrows. Oh, I like it. Basically a big bomb attack of just raining arrows from the sky. I like it. it takes a long time to recharge, but that makes sense. Oh, explosive arrows, I think. Unless that was the wizards doing, I'm not sure. It's done. Okay. So far so good. Oh, yep. Explosive arrows. Confirmed. Explosives confirmed. Okay, now let's not get killed by the big monster again. Oh, that's a boomerang attack. Did not realize that. Guys, a little help here. Oh, hi there. Ah, we got incoming. From behind. All right, the bots are very capable. I will give them that. They are actually useful. Oh, I died. Ah, shame I can't just follow the one guy around. He'll probably be dead soon. Zen, fight for your life. Come over here where I can see you. Okay, don't come over here. There's a nasty mage. There's a troll train man. Kill the big guy. I can't tell where his health is because I can't see him. Zen, where are you? So that would be a nice feature to be able to watch the remaining characters. Oh, I can. Okay, I just had to click on the name. Got there just in time for him to die. Well, interesting. But I think that will do it for now. I'm going to end this episode here. And next episode we'll try out the wizard. And hopefully be able to actually kill this guy. This final boss is really challenging. The, the waves leading up to it are also challenging, but not too bad. And I like the bots. The AI is actually competent. Instead of just getting in the way and being meat shields, they actually attack and, I mean, they've survived me. So, awesome. So far, I would say give this game a recommendation. It doesn't have a lot to it, for, but it's a free-to-play game, so that's to be expected. If they add a few more features more characters maybe, more waves or, or, or a campaign or something they could sell this they could probably sell this now for pretty cheap but but you know, they could get a couple dollars for it if they add more to it I'd say this is a good game, I recommend it check it out alright, but otherwise hit like, hit subscribe leave a comment below, and I'll see you in the next video bye